What's good, YouTube, man? Whew. Welcome to a, another hot take off a of hot mic. What's your boy, Photo T? Now, I woke up this morning trying to get excited for the Madden season to come. Don't worry about it. I'm, this is not going to be a long video. I just wanted to ask EA a few things and then... See if we can correct it. See if it, you can patch it in somewhere. Because I'm not reading the things that, like, I'm an old head that us old heads want to see. Because we, as players of, and supporters of the game, we don't play the MUT squads like, like that. The things that we did or we that would bring us back to the table to get my friends back to playing Madden would be to up to enhance the season mode that's what we wanted to see we wanted to see ea enhance the, the regular season not the franchise because the franchise now is called qb1 and it, you can't play with nobody but quarterback so i understand that's going to be a one player situation all right so you can have another season mode where me and my friends can be on teams even if i could create it and they could just play the games with me and because the main thing is we we want to keep up with our stacks we want to compete with defensive MVPs with each other, or maybe just against the, the rest of uh, the league, the CPU league. And I just don't want to play MUT squads because if we put that down and we play something else and then we come back to it, even the CPU would be tough because they'll have all the upgraded players, all the 99s and stuff like that, and we'll, have, we'll be stuck with what we – quit playing with usually we stop playing we only had like 85s or 84s then when we come back to it everybody be moved on to the 96 teams and all that stuff by thanksgiving we just want a, a mode where i could just pick up and play with my friends or by myself or with my friends but mainly anything that we do now like where this borderlands is wwe is nba 2k nba 2k I'll take it. I'll take it even further. NHL 19, uh, the soccer game. NBA 2K. Shoot, hold on. NFL 2K5. We still ain't. We still stuck there, still, as they're trying to get the game and the features back right. They are all let me. They all let me play with my friends in any mode I want to. Why is Why is Madden the only game that's still stuck? with a mode that they allow us to play only and they making us play that because we spend money because it costs money to keep up if you don't want to spend the rest of your life or play until the next man come out trying to grind because you will never catch up with the overalls because right right when you get your team as, team as good as they could be then they put out new cards and then it, you know it just goes i don't want to keep up with that stuff and me and my friends don't because we only have so much time we work and all that kind of stuff. We work, we coach, we do stuff that take up a lot of it. We have families. So when we sit down, we just want to play the game with our, our friends or play together. Usually, we're playing, whatever we playing, we're playing co-op because we're just kicking back, chilling. It's not really a, we're not really versus people anymore because if we, if we you know if you're playing squads, you got to play a certain way because it's going to be, they cheese you out. I, I just wanted to, to say to tell Mad Man or tell EA, that's that's really what we waiting on. I don't know about y'all, but that's really what we waiting on. I would I would I would like to play with my friends in our own world, in our own season, and we don't have to we don't have to play with everybody else. We don't have to play. We can enjoy Madden the way we want to enjoy it. We don't have to try to grind and get a good coach, grind and get a good defense. We just want to pick up the game and play, man. That's it. Pick up the game, put it on, invite my friends. We on teams, we chick chat, we catch up. That's it. But I said all that to say this, man. These are the 10 of the features that, like, was the most important. Because they add, you always going to add your top 10 features first. They're going to they gonna think, these are the features that they think is going to change the minds of people in Madden to go back and get the game. All right. So I'm going to quickly run through them because I think I said what I had to say. <clears throat> all right so you got the cuba qb1 personalized scenarios for a franchise the issue with this is like get like i said man it's probably gonna be a pretty cool mode that you're gonna get tired of at at least two months in 
you you probably get two months out of this and you're done with the game pretty much create a college qb and play through the ncaa championships you're missing so many teams what if everybody out here is hardcore fans of their team you, you didn't have alabama there ain't no auburn no georgia you got texas tech you got you put texas tech on there come on man what if what if people refuse to play this because they never they refuse to play with a team that they don't that they don't support or they don't like? That means you only you put ten teams out of uh, what two hundred NCAA teams. You you would you would have been better off leaving that off and finding another way to do it. Honestly, you could have did anything but that. I know you you, you want to slowly try to um, incorporate NCAA teams and and. and um, Try to get bring those people that you lost back when y'all shut down y'all NCAA division. I understand that, but understand that NCAA, the NCAA gameplay, and the Madden gameplay when they were when they both were coming out, they were two different whole situations. The gameplay was not even close. So I just wanted them to keep that in mind. All right, moving on. Superstar X Factor. I'm 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 really excited to see what this is gonna be about because I. I've always wanted your superstar player to have something that everybody else on the field does not have and to really understand, like, this is my superstar player. I can go to him. And I and he been catching everything today. I, I enjoy that. I like that. That's, that's, that's a pretty cool feature, but it's not a feature that's game-changing that's going to bring people back, I don't think. Play the Pro Bowl. Come on, man. Is, is now we selling the Pro Bowl? It, it's been going for a reason, man, because people playing squads and, and everything else, man. Now, the Pro Bowl would be dope if you can go through a season with your friends and like two of y'all make it and one of y'all don't, you know, that kind of stuff. You know, like I don't, two of y'all make it to the Pro Bowl off, off the team, three or four of y'all make it, all y'all make it. That, that's legit right there. And then we, that's the reason to play the Pro Bowl. But if you just playing through the season, eh, whatever. You know, whatever. Unique playbooks. Hey, haven't there always been unique playbooks? You mean, so you, so they add one thing. Don't, they, they added the RPOs and all that stuff, but it's one thing that called, that calls for them to change the, the playbooks to unique. Was that Philly Special? They showed that and they like, the playbooks are unique. We even added the Philly Special. Don't you see? These playbooks are unique. Come on, man. That's dope. That's a dope situation, but not a reason to come back to Madden. I'm just going to be honest with you. Pump fake upgrades. Now, that is a, a, a one of the new upgrades that I can say that's truly new to Madden. That upgrade is really, really new to Madden. Just seeing how you can, pull, how you can actually pull the button down by double tapping it. And like if I want if I'm gonna fake it to one side of the field, I can take I can fake it to one side and go back to the other side. Not him just throwing like pump fake in the old day. He throw he pump fake behind him. It'd be weird. It's just I'm glad they fixed that. They fixed that. They worked on some gameplay some gameplay issues that they had. But again, not enough to bring us out of retirement. Just not MUT missions. Now we did do this and the reason but the reason we stopped because we wanted to play something else now the mut missions it's very important that you can play together because it just breaks down the monotony of the game you know what i'm saying that's that's a really dope concept but i feel like you should have already thought of that oh why did why did it take three how many minutes three four minutes for you to add that feature you just figured out that was a problem yeah so that with that being said it's still no dice for me. Uh -uh. It took you four years, five years to figure out that MUT squads really needed a, a spot with or, or option to just go to the next challenge instead of backing out. Really? You never seen that feedback before? Never? Okay. On field trainer. I'm not against that because you got you got groups of people that, that come in and haven't played man before. It may it may help them a little bit more. Mm, we'll see we'll see about that but the reason i i would i said on field trainer the reason i put that on there 
or even stop to talk about it is because you think this is a top 10 feature that's gonna bring you back the on field trainer like that that's the feature like that's the feature that you you made you saying that making this an all new experience the on field trainer okay and new celebrations now i got a problem with this new celebration thing you know because when you play in the challenges, if you're a mutt player and you play the challenges, or if you even play in the season most of the time, you have it where you're not looking at the, the cut scenes. Like when you make a tackle, you just go straight to the playbook and to the next next play. So at the month or two, most <clears throat> shoot, out of ten, these two new features, maybe two will still be relevant after two months. The Pro Bro won't be irrelevant. I won't be relevant. QB1 probably won't be relevant. <clears throat> Playing the NCAA championships means starting all over with your quarterback will probably be irrelevant. Seeing that you can't take your quarterback and put him in another mode, you can't do anything else but play with him there, that'll be irrelevant after about two months after, after grinding. Depending on the new op how, to play, how the option plays play out, how the defense reacts to the option plays. If the, if the defense acts dumb and don't know, act like they don't know what they're doing or what's going on or just running past the ball, taking the wrong, the wrong read, then I can see that that's still being relevant because it's different. It's, that's it. It's different. So the, I'll, I'll say that that will be one of the things that'll, that'll, that'll still be relevant. Pump fake, relevant. It depends on what if it draws the if it draws defenders from their zones, and if it's quick enough to make a difference. Like if you pump fake, and they take them a long time to reload and actually throw the ball, then that wouldn't be relevant. People want people will do it at first, but they'll stop doing it. But now they made it easy to do. People people will do it. I just want to know how many people are gonna make a mistake. Because when when in the old Madden you double tap to do like the mid pass, the one that goes over the linebackers, I think so. So now you take that away and then you do the double tap with the pump. We'll see how that goes. So <sighs> with that being said, man, before we end this video, I'll say out of the top ten features that Madden calls new, two of them, two would really be good really that would, would be here to stay that would really impress or help people out <clears throat> and that strongly depends on how how it's used how it's abused in the games like rpas i'm pretty sure they they're gonna have to tune those i'm i'm almost guaranteed they're gonna have to tune the rpos asap asap but those that's what i wanted to talk to y'all about today man i just woke up and read it and i'm like look man this this is not enough. I it's only one thing they can do, and that's fix the season mode where I can where you can play with your friends, and you don't have to grind or be behind playing with the squads, uh, playing in, in the squad section. I just want to pick up, play with a regular team, three on three, go through the season, and keep it moving. <clears throat> I don't want to be stuck grinding mad and worry about if I if I if I let it go for a minute and then come back to it, I'll be too far behind, man. That's it, EA. That's on my wish list. Just let me play with my friends. Please let me play with my friends in a season mode where we can keep stats. That's all we want. I mean, you do it in every other game that you own. Just do it for Matt. I know why you won't, because you won't make no money if they do it. But at least you'll get me back. You know, a couple of old heads. All right, man. I'll catch y'all boys next time, man. Thanks for listening to me on this hot mic.